Hello and welcome. My name is Sunshine, the project manager, Sunshine Resources. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make transparent liquid soap at home. If you're new to this channel, I suggest you subscribe so that you do not miss any of our videos each time we upload them. And in this video, I'm going to take you through the step-by-step -step process of how to make transparent liquid soap at home. Transparent liquid soap is made from the following materials. These are Dexapon, Sodium Lauryl Sulfate, also known as SLS, Sodium Chloride, also known as Table Salt, Color, and Perfume. Now before we go into the production process proper, let's go through the safety precautions you will take as you do this production. Avoid direct contact of chemicals with the skin or eyes. Keep all chemicals out of reach of children and do not taste any chemical. Now let's establish the quantity of materials needed to produce about 8 to 10 liters of transparent liquid soap. Texapon, 500 gram. Sodium lauryl sulfate, also known as SLS, 150 gram. Sodium chloride, also known as table salt, 350 gram. Color, a tablespoon, and perfume, 20 ml. Now these are the materials. This is Texapon. This is SLS. This is sodium chloride, the common salt we have in the market, and this is perfume. This is color. In this production, we are making about 8 to 10 liters of transparent liquid soap. This means that we are using about 8 to 10 liters of water. Now measure some water into a container and mix the texapon in the water. Now stay the mixture very well. Please note that it is going to take quite some time for the texapon to dissolve in the water. Just keep stirring for at least 10 to 15 minutes. Now just like you may have noticed, when making transparent liquid soap, only 5 items are required. These are texapon, SLS, salt, color and perfume. Now the fact that we are using just 5 items here does not make the soap less effective. The liquid soap made by this process is as effective as any other liquid soap. Now you can add the SLS to the solution and continue stirring. Now allow the solution to stand for a while to allow the texapon absorb water and dissolve properly. Now let me see here that bulk of the work you will do in this preparation is the stirring process. Thank you. 
Now we're going to add the salt to it. Please notice what happens when you add the salt. The solution becomes thicker and thicker as you keep adding the salt. The salt we are using here is the common salt, that is the one you get in the market. The salt you already know, that's the one we use to cook our food in the kitchen. Now the salt is acting as a thickener and also as a preservative. So in this preparation we are not using any preservative because the salt is acting as a thickener and as a preservative. Now we're going to gradually dilute with water to our taste. Keep adding water until you get the kind of consistency you want. However, for effective output, the water should not be more than 10 liters, based on the measurement we have quoted here. Please note that the more water you add to it, the more transparent it becomes. But you must let it stand for a while before the transparency will appear. Because the more you stir it, the more turbid it becomes. Now you can add your color. Add the color to your taste and stir properly.
and now you can add your perfume. You can also add the perfume according to your taste. Now stir the soap solution properly, allow it to stand for some minutes. And now ladies and gentlemen, our transparent liquid soap is ready for use. This is the final product, as you can see it is transparent. Transparent liquid soap usually has an inviting appearance. So thank you very much for watching and God bless you if you like this video. Give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can visit our website on www.sunshineresources.org.ng You can visit our YouTube channel on youtube.com forward slash c forward slash sunshine resources SRTV. You can also follow us on our Facebook page on Sunshine Resources. Thank you very much for watching and God bless you.